This is why I don't get excited about patch notes, man. Why even bother when everything they do is they rebalance the champion by 1% win rate, which is like a super small buff. Champions move so fast with win rates with small buffs, so... Why even get excited for, 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 for buffs or nerfs? They're not gonna do anything in majority of these cases. Like, what are the actual buffs that might matter? Gangplank, this one might matter because the champ's already good. Uh, Lee Sin could matter, he got a lot of buffs. Lissandra, this is huge for support also because some people play su uh, support Lee Sin to Rakan. So yeah, this might matter for competitive play. Uh, Nunu will not matter, Pike will not matter. Syndra is a good buff because champ is pretty good already. Um, Twitch will not matter, Zix will not matter even though he's not there anymore, I think. And then champ nerfs Rek'Sai, does nothing in pro play. Renekton and Zarya, I mean, this, this two might matter a little bit. Renekton losing 4 MR, like, nice. It's not that big, but nice, man. And Zarya 5 MS, that's pretty decent. Round and zoom and buff. That's just good. That just basically nerfs crit champions. You guys have to understand something, okay? The round and zoom and buff is probably a bigger nerf to Gangplank than the Gangplank, the, the Gangplank buff that he's gonna receive. That's how sad this is. Or like, Seeker's arm guard, like... This is just Riot saying, hey, Tristana mid, go fuck yourself, because if you play Tristana mid and you by any chance have another crit ADC in your team, it's out to lose because enemy buys round in. And this is just a nerf to like Jace maybe, because like Seekers can be like a Jace nerf or whatever. Um, other than that, like, this just doesn't do anything. You have to understand, like, 70% of these buffs are just like, hey, we're gonna give 1% win rate in solo queue to, like, this, uh, to the people who main these champions to make them happier about League of Legends. That's it. This is why this game is, like, way too hard to balance for competitive play and for normal average play because Riot can't buff anything to the good extent unless they force a champion competitive like Rakan, they just want to have Rakan permanent competitive that's why they never nerf him nice patch notes guys, love it, very fun Syndra with E CD went from 17 to 16, won't change much it will because her E is a very important spell and having lower CD on it is, does matter It's last max spell, so I think it's pretty nice buff. It doesn't matter if Syndra's E is max spelled as maxed. Sorry, last max spell because her E cooldown does not go down with time with spells. Syndra E cooldown is flat at every level, so the fact that it's maxed last or first makes no difference. The cooldown is the same, which means the cooldown of Syndra E being buffed is gonna be a buff from Syndra to Syndra at level one to eighteen. Worst Lawis game, basis tent is better than this purple little shit. No, I disagree. 